We get to take this interview outside with head coach Shane Beatty's the Okanagan Sun Open main camp in just a couple of weeks, or a couple of days, actually. Uh, coach, we got quite a workout going on back here. What's happening back here? Well, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday right now, we got about 40, 45 kids out here training with us and um, just getting ready for July 4th and the kickoff to the new season. A true testament on what you have brought to the Okanagan Sun the last couple of years where you're really focusing on the fitness aspect, aren't you? Well, it's so important. Eh? The off-season is where we make our gains and um, get ready for the upcoming season. and. We've seen such drastic improvements in these kids, and we started off with a group of about 15, and now, like I said, we're about 45. Um, we had about 48 kids here in the offseason. I think everybody but three has been training with us. So, um, you know, our D-line, our O-line, everybody's just put on drastic gains. I mean, you look at Jonas Gehring, he's 255 right now, and um, ready to rock and roll. Lucas is 252. Um, Matt McConnell, Beck are both 215 at safety. So we're looking good, really good. The, the fitness is there. The, the strength, no doubt, is there, but the hunger is also there after last season. Well, when you get kids texting me if they're going to be a minute late for weights or, wow. you know, ask if they can make up a, a missed weight class or anything like that, you know the kids are hungry. Um, we have almost had perfect attendance for months now. So, um, you know, you look at that, that just shows their commitment to the program and to the family of the Okanagan Sun. Mm -hmm. Main camp kicks off on Friday with registration then Saturday. The main difference is, tell me, between spring camp and main camp or what? Well, we get 10 hungry D linemen ready to come back. We get all the kids we wanted. Um, I think we offered 34 kids and got 33 of them. So if you look at those numbers, it's pretty impressive. And, uh, you know, we feel really good about our nucleus. And the kids that we brought in or the young kids are just such a good, you know, outlook for the future of our program. And then the returners we got, I honestly feel we got five kids in our, in our defense that could be draftable or CFL potential. The competitiveness for which position will be the highest? <sighs> DNs, D line, we got about 10 D linemen that are all about 6'3, 240 plus. Uh, DNs, we got six of them that are just, we're going to play them all. Um, o line, we got nine, 10 kids coming in, but nine that can really play. Um, running backs, we got four, really happy with. But I'd have to say DBs and wide receivers, just loaded. Yeah. Uh, really happy with that. I mean, you look, you got Matt McConnell, CFL potential, Beck Fullerton, CFL potential, Van Nisroy, CFL potential, and Turek. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of competition. Cord, Cord Delente has been playing his ass off, or playing his butt off, and, and um, it's impressive. So I'm really pleased. I, I cannot express how happy I am with their work effort in this offseason. So, so, so with so much talent coming in, guys coming from all over the country, as far as offense goes and scoring points and weapons and that kind of stuff, do you change much from last season? We're changing a lot on offense. Um, a lot of motions, a lot of flips, um, a lot of three tight end sets, two two backs. We're going to um, pound them at them. And then a lot of five five R sets and um, be very very multiple and um, give the kids an opportunity to play. We're gonna have certain packages, give kids opportunities to get in there. And um, I'm excited. You know, uh, Coach Patchell and, and Coach Howes have been a great addition, and having Coach Nagy back is phenomenal. So putting our minds together and meeting a lot and um, getting ready for this upcoming season. It's I'm really excited. Really excited. And Bodrell's doing a hell of a job on defense. Will this look like an offensive um, American style team coming into this year? Completely. Yeah. A lot of two backs, one tight, and um, you know people have to prepare for it, and um, it's going to take them some time. And um, you know that's the nice thing about instead of just lining up five R like we did for the last twenty years. Yeah. Well, coach, thanks for doing this. Thank you, sir. And good work with this turnout. Yeah, I'm stoked. <laughs> really stoked. Head coach of the Okanagan Sunshine, BD Main Camp kicks off this weekend.